this text is EVP captions from EVPs I hear later while editing. If you want to hear it, I suggest listening with headphones. I'm in Cedar City, Utah, and I started out in the rain and cold, and except for being super cold, it was gorgeous. It was just such a cool ride. I was communicating a little bit with my guides, and I know at one point they showed me some flashing lights. I feel like there's a cop right up here. And I was kind of stuck in a line of traffic, and it was kind of a reassurance that, like, you're lucky you're in this traffic because we come around a corner and it's flashing lights from road crews, but it's cool because I'm getting that information. So that's one thing. And then um, I'm checking in and I ask, so what's paranormal or weird or strange around, around here? She said, well, we do have this woman at the pool. And it's like... I'm thinking, yeah, I don't know if I buy that. But I started seeing a little tiny bit of movement in this room. So I do think we've got somebody at least at this hotel. And if somebody were at the pool, they'd be aware of stuff going on around the hotel. So, I feel, like, um, I feel like I'm getting questions about, is it time, is it okay for me to do this? Like there's debate on whether or not this is um, safe or appropriate or whatever. Yeah, I'm distracted, distracted by some stuff here. Some of these rooms are just not very clean. <laughs> I'm gonna wear flip-flops while I walk around and I didn't even wanna get on the bed. But anyway, um, yeah, let's tune in. Is it okay for me to tune in? Feeling a twinge on this hand. Ow, right here. Trying to pay attention to my ears ringing. Is there a message in there? Is there a reason why I keep being drawn to the bathroom area? Besides, I mean, it's probably the best light we have. I keep distracting myself or moving away from talking about the spirit. Who's here? Okay. I'm Brett, I'm a psychic medium, and I like to film my interactions with you guys on the other side. So if you're unsure about communicating with me, being recorded, being on audio or video, please talk to my team, my guides, and follow their instructions. And please don't use names instead. Describe yourself. Tell me about who you are. Tell me about what you like, tell me about where you are and why you're there. I feel like the temperature is changing in here. It's getting slightly cooler. I turned off the air conditioning, so that's not that. Right now, Right now I'm not seeing anything. I'm not, not getting anything like that. Am I able to communicate with whoever this is here? Okay, I feel like a touching on this wrist, the top of this wrist, and then also I feel like somebody is hanging right behind me. Will you show up on video? Will you show up on the camera? I think they're looking at the cameras right now. Alright, so there is a woman sitting on the bed. She just sat there. Kind of like doing the whole like, oh, this is... It's soft. <laughs> yes, it's extra soft. 
She seems uh, dressed really nice or her manner is really nice. I'm not actually seeing what she's like, what she's wearing or seeing her necessarily, but I feel like she's, she probably does not belong in the cheapest motel in the area. If that's, that's a social class thing, <laughs> I don't know. I belong in the $10 more than the very cheapest, but I'm willing. I'm willing to take the top echelon of uh, places to stay. I just can't afford it. More touching on my hand, my hand. Somebody's saying something about lightning. Am I getting any communication from this person? No, but I'm touched on the nose. Is there anything, anything to tell me? I think everybody's kind of trying to decide whether or not uh, they should. Are you guys actually talking out loud? Am I getting EVPs? I think I am. Because I just heard yes, yes you are. I'm getting direct answers. I'm not getting uh, like conversational stuff. So how many spirits are at this hotel? asking right now or does it, does anybody live here does anybody live here somebody's saying a woman in red what does she do another twinge on my foot I think that I think my guides want me to shut this down want me to stop Yeah, it's kind of like I can't, I can't communicate, <laughs> I can't communicate satisfactorily, satisfactorily, see, I'm unable to, com it's not just speaking, I'm unable to communicate effectively and serve everyone who's interested in talking because I am closed up a little bit and so it's kind of like a bunch of spirits would like to talk but since I'm unable it's kind of like it's annoying and stressful is that correct does that make sense But I get a lot of sympathetic, uh, sympathetic responses. Am I? Am I getting sympathetic responses? I'm definitely picking up um, like a empathic feel. Feeling really sad. Is this the woman? Is this a man? The woman in red doesn't speak. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, my guides want me to stop. They say it's uh, this is not good for me too, because I'm I'm not using my energy effectively. If anybody needs assistance, please talk to my team. Talk to my guides. They're already on it. 
they're already helping. Is anybody... Is anybody going up? Not right now. Okay, so this must be stuff I'm not supposed to talk about or deal with. There's some stuff going on right now. So anyway, um, thank you everybody, and thank you. It's just weird, it's just weird for me. All right, thanks. <laughs>